Morning, one. This is the news burst. It's Monday morning, 48 degrees in Milwaukee, Waukesha at 45 to get you started in this work week. The rest of the storm team forecast from Scott Steele. Scotty's got a few showers early, then decreasing clouds and seasonal with a high today near 63 degrees. In the news, Governor Scott Walker has an opponent for 2014. Madison Democrat Mary Burke announced her candidacy in a highly produced video that was released on YouTube. Burke is a multimillionaire and former executive of her family business, Trek Bicycles. Kenosha officials revealed they are close to a deal that will bring Amazon.com jobs to the city. The internet retailer looking to build a warehouse near I-94. City Council is set to vote on the proposal tonight. A thousand new jobs expected. Waiting to learn more about a suspect who was shot by police in Jackson during a robbery. Police report an employee at the Culver's was hurt while struggling with the suspect. That was early Sunday morning. Officers claimed the suspect pointed a gun at them and that's when they opened fire. A woman accused of setting her ex-boyfriend's apartment on fire will be in court. Police say Trisha Krieger torched the Watertown apartment building last Sunday. Several people hurt after jumping out of a second-story window to escape. That bridge up in Green Bay is still sinking. The I-43 bridge that spans the Fox River closed indefinitely. Repairs ex expected to cost in the neighborhood of $50 million. But the federal government has agreed to cover most of the cost. Sports should find out today. How badly Clay Matthews is hurt. NBC Sports reporting that the defensive superstar may have a broken thumb. Just a thumb. It's fine. May need surgery. But in my medical opinion, you can wait on the surgery and we we'll just, you know, tape it up. You can have robo thumb for a while or inoperable thumb, whatever. Packers next opponent, good matchup. Defending Super Bowl champs. Game is in Baltimore. Ravens are 3-2. and two. Packers are back to 2-2 two and two with that 22-9 win over the Lions. Sam Sotis is in today for Susie. Susie's on vacation. She'll be back Wednesday. Sam, did you watch the Packer game yesterday? Of course. See, she's from here originally. Now back home. Go Pack Go. Nice job, Sam.